how has it been for you? It's been it's been tough. It's been tough on lots of different levels. I mean, firstly, just seeing her going through the the show and some of the I think, frankly, some of the bullying that yeah. she was yeah. victim yeah. to, uh, that was really difficult because you're so helpless. You can't really do much no. at all. Um, and I think I've, I've seen her in situations before where she's gone away and she's been filming in difficult environments, but there's always been some contact. This yeah. time there isn't. Yeah. There's nothing I can do. Are you do. her backup? Because Syra is a... She's an incredibly strong person. She's a very strong and direct personality, which in, in some cases can rub people up the wrong way, which it looks like that's what's happened here. But are you, are you actually her backbone? Is it you that obviously she, she talks to when she comes home and gets that strength? She does, but she is very independent. So, uh, but yeah, I obviously act as backup to try and um, get her through that kind of roller coaster yeah, journey that you yeah. talked about. But it, it, it's been you know, it's been really difficult watching her, seeing her being a bit victimised. Yeah. And, 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 and the real true Syra, I think, is going to begun, begin to come across. Yeah. I think she yeah. had a little breakdown earlier on. Yeah. Um, even though she, she said beforehand that she probably wouldn't get into that situation. Yeah. But now, now it's happened. It just shows you how tough it is. It gets so yeah. inflated in that, doesn't it? it because does. you have no sort of other stimulus, no nothing to read, watch yeah. or whatever. But how does that... Did, when you watched that, did you sort of literally want to reach inside the television and take yeah. her out? Yeah. Very much so. Uh, it's very... I, it's very... It's... I have to say, I've had sleepless nights, and I'm, I'm really... I'm the calm one in the yeah, relationship. Yeah, yeah. I'm calm and easygoing, but I... Literally, for the last week, I'm kind of waking up every night at, like, 3 or 4 o'clock and thinking, oh... And you wh know. Why, why is she doing it? Well, how did you come to that decision? I mean, frankly, it was. I mean, it's a business decision. It's a, you know, yeah. it's a decent. You know, she she took the decision. Initially, my reaction was, oh, I'm I'm not sure. This is yeah, going to be yeah. quite tough, and you're quite yeah. exposed. But it's a decision that she took, and, and it didn't take me long to come round to it. Once she started talking about where it was, it is a risk. Yeah, but you haven't told your children that she's there. They think mummy's away. They don't think they? They mummy. Know they know mummy's doing. away filming, and they're eight and five, so they're not at the age where it's really going. It's not like they're going to go into the playground because they're no, off and school they're on anyway. Holidays, yeah. They're on yeah. holiday, um, but it, it's it's yeah it's it's. They, they're missing her. I, I've got to manage the two of them. <laughs> it's school holidays. We're supposed to go away. Everyone can imagine what that's like. Yeah. And, uh, and Mummy's now not coming with us. And she can't call or anything? She can't call. I mean, normally what can happen is she can, she'll be away filming and, and they'll miss her, but she'll ring in and or do some FaceTime or something like that and mm. they can actually see her. But they can't, so they're finding that a bit puzzling. Mm. And that's hard on me, so I'm getting... I don't get stroppy with them, but I'm getting, like, you know, the, when they're getting a bit anxious, so it's quite... So now difficult. your backup's gone. Tricky. Yeah. My backup's gone for her, you know, so it's 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 difficult. If she, if she goes around. the whole hog, how long is she in there for? Uh, she's going to be in there at least, to, uh, I think it's towards the end of August. Oh, wow. wow. Quite a long you know, so that's yeah. two, we, we'd plan to go to uh, go away to France and to Croatia and, you know, so do, do you regret I'm, it I'm, I now? <laughs> do you regret saying, yeah, OK, go for it? No. Because do you think Syrah re will regret it? At the moment, I don't think so. No. I think I think you'll see. I think if people want to see the real Sarah, because she she can be those that people that know her know yeah. her genuine. Oh, yeah. good, she's good lovely. Person. A heart, she is. such a huge she's heart. A, she's a massive heart, and those that don't know her, I'd encourage her to 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 try and see how she she mm. gets on over the and next. She's few very weeks. different to them, aren't they? Because they're all a she bit is. rowdy and a bit. She wears she's and so disrespectful. And I mean, so what Marnie did to her with her breast and that was just that, that really uh, that that's probably the moment that I. I think the incidents with, with Bear were difficult, but the incident with Marnie, that was really that, that was really low. To us, she's she's a really tough cookie. She's an intelligent, warm human mm. being, but but you know, she's tough. But we've seen her crack very, very early on in yeah. this. We, are you surprised by that? Or do you think it's a sort of emotional release and now she can hopefully settle down and, and I think bed in? I think it's the, the latter. I, I, I was surprised that she cracked. She seemed to get be involved fairly early yeah. on. Her way of operating is to try and understand people. Yeah. She wants to know who people are around them. She's not playing any games. She wants to know who's there. She's confident. And mm. because she's done that, some, have taken, some of them have taken that the wrong way. Yeah, They've yeah. taken it to be patronising, when all but she's trying to do is to understand them. They're these people. Yeah. They are. And that, that's, not, that's not her... It's not just a generation gap, it's kind of a behavioural gap yeah, as well. Yeah, she yeah, never yeah, behaved yeah, like yeah, that. Exactly. No. What, what would you say to... I mean, Syra, she's had a fair amount of criticism. Um, well, she's had a fair amount of criticism professionally. Obviously, we all get it on this yeah, show. Yeah. But since she's been in, in the house, what would you say to Big Brother viewers? And what would you say to those who have criticised her? I'd say uh, give her the chance. 
look at how she really behaves over the next few weeks. If you don't know Syrah and you're just taking these little sound bites and little edit shots, have yeah. a look at what she's done in the past. Look at the, th look at some of the hardships she's been through. Mm. She grew up, you know, in an immigrant family that where mum and dad didn't speak any English. You know, we've been through so much. Yeah. We've and adopted I love children. Adopted, adopted, yeah, you yeah, know, they, so, yeah. they did a document. We did a documentary on adopting a kid. She's a genuinely yeah. good person. Sarah to win. Sarah. Yeah. presents when he came on earlier. Chessie's got a few for you. There we go. You can keep these. You can keep our cut out of Zyra. And we've got a little pillow with her picture on, so you don't have to miss her. There we go. Thank, can we just say a big thank you to Steve for yep. coming in? For more Loose Women action, click here. And I'd subscribe if I were you. It's totally free and it means you'll be kept up to date with new videos and exclusive YouTube content.